Hi guys, this is uh, Javed Kolachi again with my new video on schizophrenia. For uh, those of you who know me, you know the, you know that I'm ex schizophrenic. I was diagnosed with acute schizophrenia some uh, seven years ago, and I was put up on medication for uh, two years. Uh, but unfortunately, the medicines did not work on me, so I had to uh, leave the medication and I started doing my own treatment. And today I am fit and fine. With, I do not have any mental illness and I do not have any schizophrenia. I was diagnosed with uh, acute schizophrenia uh, and a chronic schizophrenia whereby 85% of my brain was uh, affected with schizophrenia. And uh, I used to have trouble uh, thinking. I used to have trouble uh, walking i used to have immense pain in my uh, back uh, pain in my chest and i used to be in terrible terrible condition so uh, but uh, no problem today i'm uh, free and i'm uh, i'm happy about it now um, for those of you you know me that uh, i always come up with new videos on uh, uh, how to treat yourself how to cure your schizophrenia without the help of medication now, uh, schizophrenia is a, a disease which is, uh, which is really terrible, horrible. It is life-taking uh, disease, but uh, you don't have to worry about it. We can uh, cure ourselves 100% without the help of medication. Uh, let me tell you about uh, myself before I begin with uh, uh, the new topic on this video, my experience which I have been through. Uh, I have been uh, schizophrenic for uh, 45 years. Now, 45 years means a lot of time, a long time, and I have been uh, torturous. My life has been torturous throughout my schizophrenic uh, life. Um, it's just that I did not know that I am schizophrenic. So, um, I was diagnosed uh, seven years ago, like I said earlier, but then I had schizophrenia for 45 years. So, it was just that, you know, I did not know about it. Now, uh, for uh, those of you you know that uh, who know me, you know that I talk about cure, and at the same time I talk about my experiences throughout my 45 years of my schizophrenia. Now, uh, the reason, uh, the core reason for me to talk about my experiences is just to uh, uh, let you guys uh, have courage and encourage you guys to stay grounded, stay on your feet. The help is on the way. There is help. You do not have to commit suicide or do not have to suffer alone or do not have to, you know, think that that there's no cure for your condition. And the circumstances, the experiences which I have been through, you will take a positive note from that, that if I can come out of uh, uh, schizophrenia while uh, having to have those uh, experiences throughout my life, then I'm sure you can come out too. And uh, I take my uh, case as worst, worst case among all uh, schizophrenic because I uh, I know what I have been through. So uh, uh, stay uh, connected with me. You will get a lot of information on how to cure yourself without the help of medication. Now, what does medication do? Now, medication uh, really does not work. It might work on uh, cases of uh, like you know minor kind of uh, schizophrenia or minor conditions but if you are uh, schizophrenic like me acute schizophrenia chronic uh, schizophrenia uh, then the medicines do not work you gotta really do something at home and the steps which I have listed in my other videos they are uh, you know the treatments which you can do at home so uh, you can just check out my other videos where I have listed tons of uh, information on how to cure yourself of schizophrenia and also my uh, experiences with how to cure uh, yourself or what I have been through. Now, uh, for today, in today's video, I'm going to talk about my experience, uh, what happened, uh, what used to happen while I was schizophrenic. Now. Uh, the moment you hear what have happened to me, you will take it <coughs> uh, positively that uh, the things, the worst things which have <coughs> happened to me, uh, and uh, today I am schizophrenia free, I do not have any mental illness. You can take a uh, note that if I can get 
cured if I do not have any more schizophrenia then I'm sure if you are going through one of these circumstances that you can come out of these uh, circumstances this uh, schizophrenia uh, by yourself too so uh, it is nothing nothing great it's just that we gotta know the right ways and the right things we gotta do to uh, be free of schizophrenia now uh, let me talk about uh, today's uh, experience experience what used to happen was uh, in my brain uh, it used to be, you know, sometimes it used to be like something has gone out of my ears uh, forcefully, like, you know, something something uh, has uh, had, uh, you know, uh, forced itself to go out of my ears and leaving my brain at uh, uh, super, super sonic, super quiet. I used to feel like, oh, there's there's nothing in my in my head. There's no more voices. There's nobody in me. I used to feel lighter, and the the force used to be such that you know it was like uh, a rocket, a rocket you know, uh, who is in your head, or uh, and it goes out uh, through your ears with a force. And uh, I used to be uh, literally uh, surprised. I mean, I did not used to be uh, surprised, but then. Uh, I used to be uh, really, really like you know shaking that or oh, something has uh, something has happened, and it used to be uh, through uh, used to happen throughout my uh, not throughout my schizophrenic life, but in, in the later uh, later parts, later uh, uh, years of my schizophrenia while I was doing my uh, treatment. So uh, if you have these conditions, you can be sure that uh, you are schizophrenic and that you can treat yourself of schizophrenia. And uh, let me tell you who, who, is the, uh, who is the culprit behind schizophrenia. Now, uh, the evil spirits. I have talked about this in every uh, video that evil spirits are the culprits, culprits and, uh, of schizophrenia. Uh, what happens is uh, these evil spirits, they come and sit in our bodies, in our minds for a long time and they possess us. So uh, once they are, you know, they make, se make themselves transformed into our bodies, into our brains, 100%, and they start to talk. It is not easy for uh, even for uh, evil spirits to uh, spread, to just come in our bodies and start talking. No, they have to really and uh, gradually get into our bloodstream and uh, get into our immune system, into our body, and they start uh, talking, start to have the voices. So uh, if you know, I mean, if you if you can believe that these evil spirits are the cause, then it will be easier for you to uh, treat the uh, schizophrenia and get yourself free of uh, uh, schizophrenia. Now the uh, you 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 gotta talk to yourself. You gotta you gotta ask yourself a question. If uh, it is your brain which is talking to you, why should your brain be talking to you? And uh, uh, why should they be talking uh, things which are you know happening to you or things uh, which are upcoming? Those are not just I mean sometimes they, those are random things, but sometimes those things are which have happened just just a while ago or yesterday or two hours ago. You know you will get repeated uh, uh, those voices in your head. So if uh, that was not uh, on purpose, then why would your uh, brain be talking to you and why would your brain be your enemy and why would your brain uh, be uh, misguiding you? Uh, why would your brain be telling you that you know you have an angel in you, and you have a friend in you, and you have uh, someone who wishes wishes you best? Uh, you are getting uh, voices of that person. Now, if that is so, why are you ruined? I mean, why is your life ruined? Why are you tortured? Why are you not let to let to sleep? Why are you bothered uh, 24/7? Why are you bothered while you are going to office? When you are going to, when you are sitting down in the office, you are doing your work. When you are bothered and you are taking showers, you are sleeping. You can't sleep. So just talk to yourself. Just tell yourself. Ask yourself a question. If that was your angel or your friend, uh, would you be suffering like this? No. And uh, will your life be uh, in such condition? What, what you are right now? Your answer will be no. So trust me, it is the evil spirits who are, you know, the culprits who are the cause of schizophrenia. So uh, don't forget to subscribe to my channel, hit the bell icon, and at the same time, so if you need my help, you can call me on my cell phone, you can leave the email, uh, or you can um, uh, leave the comments. I will definitely uh, help you guys to come out of uh, the uh, schizophrenia. So uh, uh, with that, uh, do not give up, do not give up, you can make it, do not have any, any thoughts. The thoughts, you will have no control over them, 
the thoughts will come in your mind but you just have to ignore them do not accept them do not follow up do not act upon them then you you will you will do great so with that uh, happy life happy schizophrenia free life take care bye bye